A whole new world in a post maze scenario. Whoa. That was weird. That was weird. <laughs> somehow I was I was in static mode like this. But it was also rotating the camera somehow. That was a weird moment. Okay, so we teleported through the wall after finally solving the maze. And there's a weird route. Which is a nice sight, at least. The forked root looks cool. Alright. What have I gained by coming here? I wonder if we'll finally get the other side of the bridge that we saw at the very, very, very beginning, because we still haven't found that. And this looks dense enough. Oh, is it just a... I think it's just a path to another teleport. I'm trying to look around in case I'm missing something. No, nah, looks like we just teleport again. Oh. You look familiar. Or no, you don't. Nope, this is not the same cave path I saw before, I don't think. I don't remember this part. And it would be weird if it was that one anyway, because we've, uh... Yeah, that we used that to get to where we are in the first place, so it wouldn't make sense. Oh, it's... It's you again. Okay. I bet that this is here to show you how the armored one happens, in case you haven't figured it out yet. So you can figure out how to make that image if you want. I assume clearing this out completely is a good idea. Uh... Is that it? I mean, I guess there's nothing else here, so do I, I guess I just go back through the maze. And we go visit our gondola and maybe it's- maybe it works now. I mean, if not, the maze is still nice and finished as far as I can tell, and that, uh, right now, I believe, because I have it set up at a right angle, uh, the maze lets me go both left and right from the starting point, and since I already used the terminal on the f other far side, uh, I should never need to change the maze again to go straight, so I think I'm done manipulating this forever, except for rotating it every now and then, which I'll be doing in a moment here. Here we go. Going on up. Going on up. There we go. All better. So this is this will take us to the gondola, which I I hope does something now. <laughs> Sincerely hope it does something now, because I went and pressed those two buttons. And I think clearing the path was the right call, but if it wasn't, well, then I have to go revisit those locations again, and that would be a bummer. So let's hope that's not the case. Does that giant thing slide down like the other stuff? Is there a button hidden behind you? No, I can't slide you down necessarily. Huh. See, both of the two... Yeah, there's two open hoops over there. I don't know if every hoop everywhere is open, but the ones I've seen so far, I think, are now unblocked. Is there any controls up here? Seems like everything in the environment's a place I've been to before. So I don't think I have much I'm missing right now. Aha! Aha! Well, isn't that promising? Oh, hey. You seem nice. Oh, do I- is that what I ride in? Oh, goodness. Okay. Uh... Uh... Hope you set it all up correctly! Oh, we're about to die! That'd be bad. Bye, maze! Burn in hell. <laughs> this would be really neat and impressive and happy if I wasn't simultaneously worrying because it's probably completely unmaintained because no one's here anymore. And I could be I could be in some serious danger. Oh. That's a battle happening, isn't it? Villain versus Mojang. I mean, Mofang. 
Whoa. If Mojang was in this game, it'd be a very different conflict. So people are still fighting, so this is still fresh. Did the fight just end right when I got here? The fact that I didn't hear fighting was the weird part. I would honestly be genuinely surprised if I ever saw any of these aliens moving around besides the insect. Just because they seemed content to have everything feel empty. Even though it's recently inhabited. Oh, it, that just took right off. It's just leaving. Bye. I guess it has to go back to go uh, fill its slot at the place it came from. And if I want to take a ride from this one, maybe it would deploy one from this side. Maybe. Either way, I don't have much reason to. Oh, hello. You're new. Ah. So I could use you to block this one, right? Yep. Don't currently have a reason to do that. That's that's the system here. All right, we'll head on down. Let's go learn what's going on over here. This lead anywhere or is it a dead end? I think I'm gonna go with dead end. Oh. Uh. I think that's the storage. What were they called? What were they called before? Chambers? Capsules? We were reading that these implications that perhaps something was happening to all these people. And I think that's where I think that's where everyone is, right there. I think I think they called it chambered. Ha! Huh. This time there's only they've changed the number of nodules here. Instead of there being instead of being nine, there's eight. What purpose does that serve exactly? What do you even govern? I wonder. Uh, let's take it easy by just going with one. See what that does. Oh, it's not reacting. Is it slowly looking for number one to bring it up? Whoa. Oh, it took me down. I think it took me down to the first floor. Oh. Okay, let's try three. That's exactly what it does. It's taking me to specific floors. Who's that? Oh. That's one of those aliens. Okay, can I interact with this at all? It's just he's kind of here. Alright, give me a second. I need to bring back my number list. Alright, so this is three. Let's try two. Might as well check each floor to see what we find. Oh, I might be able to rotate this thing too if I find. Does this does this do anything? It's just a light, isn't it? So, two is empty. One and two are both empty. You can't really see that from here, though, can you? No, not really. Huh. Can you rotate this whole thing? Like, the whole platform? Looking for any kind of other controls? Nah? All right, uh, we'll try four. Maybe we'll see people from the town. Yeah, there's a human. They're just stored in here. That's a cool illusion of like a 3D image. Cause I'm sure it's a I'm sure it's just a picture of a human. Like, they didn't make it- I don't think this is a model, I think this is just a, a photo. But they did like a... Sort of a 3D trick to make it look like you can see the edges of his head. Probably a, a different kind of camera. So, uh, what's number five? Where is my diagram? There we go. Five, I believe? 
I don't know if I should expect something to happen as I go down this and find a specific one that's interesting. Or if it's just like, oh, look what's in each level, and then that's it. I don't know if I'm accomplishing anything right now, but I'm curious. Hello. So we have another human. So I can't wake these people up, right? They're all they're all stored away here. And this was intentional. Okay, so. Next we'll try six. Well, it's a good thing I made the numbers. <laughs> I made my diagram for the numbers. I it only goes up to ten though. I have ten I have up to ten. And I have 15, and then that piece of paper has notes for 18 and 158. Is that the other alien we haven't seen yet? I think it is. You can't see crap through this, though. I keep wanting to get a proper look at look at that guy. The, uh, the humming giants. Alright, so this was 6. 7 looks like... Like me messing up my document and scrolling a little bit. There we go. Seven looks like three, basically. Oh. Oh. Seven looks like three plus four. <laughs> this is the symbol for three, and this little thing is the symbol for four. And you put them together, and it makes seven. You can literally add the two. I don't know if they all work that way, necessarily. I don't know if any of them work that way. Maybe this is a coincidence. But, but that's interesting that, that 3 plus 4 equals 7, symbolically. Oh, you can see him way better. Uh, whoa, what's this? He's got, like, teeth on the sides of his face. They almost look like a halfway point between, like, a... Oh, weird. Weird. They have like the. They almost have the mouth of a uh, Turian, but then the body of like uh, their body is a little bit more like the creatures from Oddworld or something. All right. So eight looks like this for some reason. So what is eight? <laughs> is eight it's two plus six for example? Is that what it could be? Not really, no. No, I'm trying to look at the diagrams, and 8 does not look like... Oh, wait, that's 9 on accident, whoops. So 9 looks like 8 plus 1, because this is 8, and if I add the one little line, it'll become... It'll become 9. But yeah, this is 8 for some reason. Uh, what does 8 look like? Yeah... I don't... 8 doesn't look like two things added together the same way. What's in here? Yep, oh, another human. Are any of them female? Gonna have some... Uh, I mean... It's a little hard to tell when it's all, uh... Crystalled up and on the glass. That could be a... That, that one could almost be female, but probably not. Alright, so... Switch to nine. So far, I don't really see... A function for what I'm doing besides just, you know, exploring the weird state that everything's in now. Oh, and they keep going down to lower lo lower layers, too. Oh, this one's empty. I could just hop right in there and just embrace the sweet peace of whatever, th whatever I think they're trying to accomplish here. Unfortunately, I'm running out of floors, uh, of numbers I know. I could skip straight to 15 if I, because I think I know that one. This one's empty completely. And they just keep going down. Alright, let's go back to the surface. This has been a field trip, basically. I'll come back if I have a reason to, but yeah, I think, I think we've seen most of the variations. The humans will have a few different appearances, but other than that, yeah, it's a few of both types of aliens. That's what's interesting, is that there's members of all alien ra uh, races in here, apparently. Well, I didn't see any of the bugs, but the bugs just seem to be happy to go and live on their own planet regardless. And they don't seem to be involved in the conflict. 
But, it, uh, I mean, I think there was, like, ambassador members. I think there was people of every race that were all working together. This is just the top of the gondola. Whoops. So it was maybe some of those were all cased away even while the, re the rest of the race, perhaps, was fighting. Some collapsed leaves everywhere. There's a screen in there. Can I go over here? Nope. Any any dead around here? That's where the blasts were happening earlier. Oh, there he is. Poor guy. Um. Can, can I fix this? Are you are you gonna die? Don't die. You can do anything about it. Try not to die. Did that thing shoot you? What is that? Nightmare puzzle thing. Well, we have our first ever moving 3D model we're near. That's cool. Two, two, two. Well, why do they say that? Do I need to look up the number for 222? Or do I just need to type a two into something? So they're all saying that, huh? And there was a little symbol down here. Was that indicating what? how did it write it? Let's look at that. Start over, please. There it is. Oh, oh, now it's just warping all over the place. Oh. It's just saying numbers. Okay, um... So you're closed until I undo you. With something somewhere. Oh, hey. Um... Not gonna open? You're gonna go down? Really? I can't look at the book that seems rather important. Okay, now it's opening. Sure. Ah, uh, That's everyone. These are the records of everybody who's in there. Hey, Farley is in there. Pod number 194, floor 2, position 12. I don't know if I know how to do posi specific positions. But, but yeah, everyone's here. Species... There are species of book and crate. Oh, right, they said they were storing, uh... They were storing supplies and stuff in certain spots. Okay. Okay, so this is... Remainer, a trar is a remainer. This is like a name of every name we... This is every name we know, basically. All on a big list. I just need to know what I'm looking for. Do I know what I'm... Do I know what I want? Let's see. Two, two, two. Let's see what two, two, two tells me. If you can open, please. So for some reason, up until now I've been clicking on the opening part of the book, now I'm clicking on the spine to open it for some reason, even though when I'm once it's open, I click on the edges of the pages to turn. If I click on the edge of this book when it's closed, it goes away instead of opening. It's a weird issue. All right, let's look for two, two, two. Oh, here it is. Joseph, human. It's, uh, floor 14, position 13. Okay. 14, 13. Now I just gotta figure out what to do with that information. Uh, I could go get the information how to get to floor 14. Uh, how do I also go to position 13? I can't go over there at all and you're just stuck here slowly dying, I guess. Can I use your gun at all? It's just stuck here? I'm surprised I can't pick it up to make it shoot the red thing to go away, because blue beats red? If I... My understanding... Isn't blue villain technology and red mofang technology, I think? Right? Because this whole place... Yeah, this whole place is the villain, right? And the mofang are the reds. Uh, yeah, I think I finally have it straight, but I... I I might still have it wrong. I haven't actually checked again. I just think I've corrected myself, maybe. Uh, no, this is gonna do anything here. It's like a generator room or something. Alright, maybe if I let Joseph out or something, he can help the injured guy? I just gotta get back to the numbers is the problem. Alright. Alright, let's see if this gets what I want done. So this should be the code for two... Two, two. Is that correct? 
I'm look, comparing. I think that's it. Let's see. Let's see. Show me what you've got. Well, it's definitely not taking me to floor two. <laughs> so it doesn't. It's definitely not just thinking it's two or something. Oh, that's a good sign. Yeah, fourteen, thirteen. That's right. Do I get him out? Is it a person? Hello. Is that the? Is that the mayor? Or something? What do I do with you? Do I? Can I let him out? Uh Um uh, mum 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 do I Is there a way to wake him up? Do you interact with me at all? No. Is there like an opening spot? Uh ha ha ha. Is there a symbol for open? Well, <laughs> I feel like a I feel like a dog that just caught a dumpster truck, uh, a dump truck, and doesn't know what to do with it. <laughs> uh, let's go ahead and leave. There's no way to interact at all, really. So maybe this was, I don't know, maybe this was just supposed to reveal the plot twist that that wasn't actually the mayor that was talking to me, but. I figured that out the first time I ever talked to them. That was pretty... That was obvious immediately to me. Um... Okay, so maybe if I go back through that door, it'll be open now, actually, because... Somebody locked me in that chamber and said 222 on all the terminals. Which seems to be their way of saying, you need to see that... You need to see that it's not the mayor, right? I think that's the point, right? Is to show... To force me to see that? Is he still alive? Did he raise his hand last time? Needs help? Can I click on his hand when he raises it? No, he's done with that. Oh, door's open. Uh, so, I can't understand him, but I think he... Oh, it makes sense. Because these guys made these machines, because these are villain machines, and these machines are controlled by vocal... They're, they're vocally controlled by them. They only added an interface for us to interact with them, because we can't control them with our voices. So he was saying 222 to send me there. He So his vocal... The things he was saying was were being shown on the screen for me to use, and 222 shows me the mayor, right? 222, Joseph. We know it's jo we know the mayor's Joseph because if if for no other if for not any other reason that's just the big blatant part which is that when you're in the mayor's office it's a Joseph for mayor uh, posters and signs are everywhere in there is he just gonna die now or what he might not die but he's pretty fucked and that he's not gonna be able to move unless I can undo this thing somehow maybe I'll find a way to blast the stuff off of him. I don't think I can give him the laser, but if I can free him and save him, then he'll grab the, uh... He'll probably grab that and take care of any of the red stuff nearby, if he can. Maybe. But what's gonna happen in here? Ooh, maybe I can hop up there and shoot it off. Oh, there's the fake Joseph. Yep. You can see that he's clearly... It's clearly a mofang in disguise. Which is what I immediately thought because of the fact that he was glowing red. And so I'm like, oh, he's glowing like the technology type we take out with the blue stuff. And he seems to have been defeated. So the two of them shot at each other. He suffered a, a, a fatal blow. Whereas this guy didn't necessarily get shot directly, but stuff fell on him. And now he's stuck. And hopefully we can get him out of here. Where's this path go? I would love if this was like the path back to the entrance. Because then that'd be... One more th loose end tied up. Oh, it might be. Is it? That sure looks like it. Yay, shortcuts. I'm so grateful for shortcuts because this place takes a really long time to walk around in. Come on. 
Come on. Uh, that should be it. Ta-da! So now when I teleport in here from the... Yeah, there's the front gate. So now when I teleport here from the teleport that's near the, the tower on Earth, the mayor's building, I can just walk straight to where we are right now, which is a hell of a progress thing. By the way, uh, I made a separate save to make this easier for myself, just called the numbers game. <laughs> so I have a let's play save and a numbers game save, uh, and the idea is that uh, I can load my other save and just use the number machine instead of having to come back and forth all the time. So naturally I would now unlock the shortcut, which then nullifies that a little bit, but whatever. At, at the very least now, if I'm, if I'm midway through a thing and I encounter the number system, I don't have to do the whole thing again. Oh no! There was two of them and this one died. He's just straight up dead. Okay, um... What is that thing anyway? I, I sh I'm probably gonna shoot it in a moment here, but should I try interacting with it? No, let's not, let's not play with it. <laughs> I, d I think it's going to try to kill me. Um, can we... So we steer you over here. <coughs> and we've learned to pull towards me to go up. Ta-da! So that's it, right? Now we have a... We have a teleporter that gives us access to the other system. What are those sounds? Oh. Wait, what's happening? Oh no, I'm locked out. What is happening? Is everyone dying? Are they becoming unfrozen? Is the whole thing gonna take off? Well, it can't take off into space, we're stuck in bubbles. Did I accidentally shoot it just now? I shouldn't have because that was blue energy and it, it wasn't red. They locked me out though, so I can't go back in there. Is that guy stuck there too? Can I not... What do I do with this? Let's see if I can undo the beam or if this will just hurt him or something. I don't know. Ah, ah. Nah, it doesn't help with the debris. Is there any red stuff around here to shoot at? No. Uh, something's happening over there. I guess we'll figure that out over time. Oh, did I destroy the teleporter too? Uh-oh. So we're not using this thing to teleport then. Whoops. I can use you at least. Why this symbol anyway? Anyway. And get you drawn in, and get you drawn in. Uh, this needs to be taken out. That one needs to be taken out. Come on. Come on. Really? <laughs> oh, this thing needs a little playtesting. Or patching. Come on, man. I'm trying to delete something. Okay, what the hell? It just won't replace. Okay, let's just hope it autocorrects. It's not that important, right? If it just lets me across? It didn't let me across, though, did it? Uh, that one's correct, that's correct, that's correct. Everything's correct except for this part being stupid. How do I fix the part where it's being stupid? Oh. Did I just get stuck? No, not quite. Uh, is it supposed to be broken, or is this a glitch? That's the question. Is, is this working as intended or not? It's come disconnected. Come on. See how easy it is? You just disconnect stuff? Except for that one? What? Why is it... Come on. I'll just draw random stuff and keep doing it. Maybe it'll auto-correct out? Ah. Uh, this entire panel thing desperately needs some kind of update. It's just, it shouldn't be this frustrating to interact with. Like, the, it's so inconsistent whether or not it'll respond to your input. And in this case, I'm... Normally, I don't complain about... I only just complain... I, like, I'll 
mention it for a moment and I'll move on because it only makes me get stuck for a moment. Wait, no, is it- is this intentional? Maybe this is intentional. Let's see, let's try to break every bond I can. Okay, I think it is intentional. I can't undo any of these parts, they're all stuck here permanently. Okay. Sorry, I'm sure you can understand why I would think it was broken, because it literally has refused my input multiple times in the past. So that got me across before. No? There we go. Can I get close enough? There we go. So, this, the, that squiggle line and that squiggle line and that squiggle line are the p components of how I got across originally, so that's close enough. I just can't draw my perfect one, because the panel's broken. That's fine. Sorry. I was getting complainy because I thought the game was broken, because, you know, <laughs> there was precedent for thinking it was broken. That whole th so the gondola shut down, so you just can't go back there. So the mayor's there, and a number of people that could have been useful were might have been there if I could have gotten them out. But now I can't unfreeze any of them, because I can't go back, probably. That thing almost looks like one of the seeds. Oh, there's the tree. Is this the end, I guess? I guess this is the finale of this planet or something. Uh, I'm sure I'll come here again to try- because I'll have to take s We'll have to take some path somewhere to get to the Mofang planet. But okay. This got me here. Space. The final frontier. Got it. And the voltage rises! Let's see the power coursing through it. So that's three trees down, one to go, right? Because there's the Earth one, and now we've finished off the bug and... The Arai? Yeah, the Arai and the villain. Then we need to go find the Mofang one, but... They're at war and actively violent, so we'll see how that turns out. Hasn't been a great time so far. I'm bummed out that I couldn't save that guy, because I can't go back to the room... I can't seem to go back to the chamber he's in now. But here we go. Back on Earth. Uh, let's... Let's go have a talk with, uh, our friend upstairs, CW. And see if that pipe has made progress? Keep saying to plug in the battery, and, uh... Last time I fin- when I finished the bug area, that battery seemed to just magically continue, like, plug itself in, basically. Like, the- the cord just kind of connected. Maybe as that extends, we'll gain access to mo some element of the- the Mofang planet. Yeah, there it goes. It's now bridged the gap instead of stopping at it, and now makes its way over to... Oh... Hello... That wasn't there before, was it? So that's the same thing they put around the seeds, but in this case, the thing they put around the seeds is now around the entire tree. That's a big deal. So are they gonna try to swap the trees themselves to break... Oh, yeah, that's how you'd fix this, right? Yeah, if you swap us with the other planet, then our two globes could be switched, and we our globe would be in Arizona again, and theirs would be back on this planet. And, well, hopefully you can then escape the globe and not be stuck in it, but at least you'd be on your own planet. That's maybe some form of progress. Uh, presum- <laughs> If you go to your own- back to your home planet, but then you're also still stuck inside the ball, that would be, uh, a bummer. For sure. But, uh, Something, I suppose. Let's see if he remarks on the thing being plugged in, perhaps? <laughs> he disappeared. He disappeared from our known universe before he actually uh, got covered up by the shield correctly. So he's been adding- he didn't even mention his battery that time, so maybe... Maybe that's not a problem anymore? That was, that was confusing for a while, because I thought I already did the only thing I could do, which is turn it on and connect it in there, but... 
Seemed like he was going to do the rest. Yep, still can only walk right up to here. That sure looks important, though. That looks like it's going to be a big deal for, like, perhaps the finale or something. Alright. Now, here's the issue. Um... I need to figure out how to even get to the Mofang planet. I don't think I've... Have I found a single portal to that place yet? There was technically the one I just destroyed. Uh, that's... That's not good news. <laughs> Hopefully that's not a big deal. Because, uh... Uh, that portal's gone now. Oh. Hello. This thing moves. So one is this map. What? <laughs> what the actual hell? Um... Wait, that's... that doesn't quite line up, does it? Okay... Is that how it's supposed to line up? Instead of drawing it in the middle, am I supposed to draw it on the side? Can I also make it line- I can also make it line up this way, right? I could, but that little- the bottom part of the five won't make sense, because it's, uh... It's floating in space and you can't do anything there. So this is the only one you can express by actually connecting all the dots. Interesting. No, I can't, because that this part of the five also doesn't connect. Um Can I make this thing tilt up and down? Is it you? Oh, I can control you, huh? Yay! Fifteen, in the middle of the symbol. We just say, to draw fifteen. Well... It's a... It's a bit of a dramatic reveal to find out that there was a second slide that shows that. That's kind of neat. But, uh... I already figured that out. <laughs> I already figured out that drawing a fifteen was important on that thing. Uh... What number was that again? Let's go review. When you type in the when you draw the 15 on here, it autocorrects to this and becomes 406. Yeah, that's that's what it was before too. Yeah, not sure the significance. Of this. I'm not sure what that one really means. Uh, well, keep in mind it could still be a clue, or I could still be doing it wrong. But that sure fits together perfectly. I thought it was. I thought that was what I was supposed to do before. I figured out how to line up the projector just because there was a, a weird slanted 15 in the room. But now that I've lined up the projector, that seems to reinforce it. But what is- what is 406? Whoa. Did you just change colors right in front of me? The leaves change colors. And like, they- they-, they it's not- they, they have- it's not that they have changed colors, it's that they do change colors. Like, over and over again. Is that because of all the systems it's hooked up to? It was green, then red, then yellow. It's gonna go back to green? That's bizarre. <laughs>